and we are back hello everyone welcome back to five minutes Code channel where i will be explaining the solution of every problem of read code and geeks for geeks within less than five minutes so that you can save your time okay so today's problem of the day is merge two sorted linked list in reverse order and i think the problem statement is self-explanatory as well so what we will be given we will be given two linked lists node and node one and node two so it's basically the head it's basically the head of the two linked list so and i think before solving this problem you guys know what is a linked list so basically linked list is a collection of nodes and each node will be having two things one will be data and another like the, each node will be having two things first one is data and another one is next so data will be like the value which is holding and next will be pointing to the next node of the linked list okay so it's basically the address of the next node okay all right so if you don't know much about the linked list i will suggest you to have a good view of it before solving this problem okay so now we will be given two linked list if you will see this example one one three two four now i have to return a new linked list such that it's in a decreasing order the new link we have to combine these two lists and return a list which should be in decreasing order so for this is four three two one okay so if you will see this five ten both of the linked list will be sorted in increasing order initially okay so what we will be 40 then 20 then 15 then 10 then 5 then 3 2 okay all right great great so i think yeah its solution is very very simple what is its solution first of all merge the linked list in increasing order so we can easily merge the linked list in increasing order and after that we will reverse the linked list and return so if you know how to reverse a linked list it is very great but if you don't know no issues i'm going to explain you in very very detail okay so as usual i've written something for you so now so now let's jump to the notes section for it okay okay all right so basically i as i already told we will be dividing this problem into two steps first one is merge the linked list in sorted order we will be given two sorted linked list so we will just merge them into sorted order and after that i will reverse the linked list and return it is linked list ll means linked list okay so how i'm going to merge so i will take a new node let's say this okay and uh, it's basically will be having zero or any value which i will which is of no importance so now there will be two linked lists this one is first this one is second with h1 and h2 as their respective heads okay so what i will do i will check if the value of this one is less than this one okay so if it is less it is less so i will do what i will make it next to this okay i will make it next to this and now h1 i will update my h1 from this which was earlier this so i will update it h1 to this point okay and in the same way then again i will compare with this h2 with this h2 h1 and whose value will be smaller i will be updating it and then moving to the next so it's basically this simple and we will be having some checks as well which i'm going to show you when i'm going to write the code okay i think it's uh, basically very basic thing so the next point is how to reverse a linked list it's a bit tricky and uh, very good as well okay so to do this we will be having a while loop first of all and we will be having current so i will take two variables current and previous okay so for each loop let me tell explain one of the loop first like one is one step of the loop so i will be doing what temp let's say i will be making a node as temp and i will make it point to current dot next okay so if you will see here so it is my head and current my previous is null okay so now what i will do temp equal to current dot next so my temp will be this okay my temp is this so basically what i have to do look currently this direction is this so to reverse this if i have to reverse this to these two nodes if i have to reverse these two nodes what we have to do i have to make it such that this node this node point to the previous and this node instead of pointing to this it should point to this isn't it isn't it great great got it got it okay cool so what how i'm going to do this first of all i will do something like temp uh, current equal to temp dot next so current is this so temp is this okay now again i have to do what temp dot next okay so next thing will be current dot next equal to previous so current dot next instead of removing this it will be moved to previous which is current null okay so this now what i'm going to i'm going to do temp dot next equal to current in this way okay uh, very simple great so in this way i'm going to just so look this much linked list is reversed now this much linked list is reversed okay so i'm going to do this so if you will if i will be writing the code for it it will be very very easy for you so now let's quickly jump out to the code section for it okay okay all right so as i told we will be having one node uh, let's say new head okay and uh, it will be something like new node i will be creating a new node of it and its value will be zero in fact first okay now i will be having 
let's say one more pointer which will be moving this will be fixed and another one will be keeping uh, updating okay so i let's write it tail or anything like uh, yeah let's write tail tail equal to the uh, new node new head okay all right so i will be running this loop till true and uh, so look if at any point node one equal to null it means what node one is null so now all the points will be of node two so i will do something like tail dot next equal to node two okay great and i will break it means uh, just break it from here and similarly i will do if i think this point is clear enough if one link list is empty so now the next all the nodes will be of the second link list so if node two is equal to null so tail dot next equal to node one okay all right and after that it means currently neither node one nor node two is null if i am going reached at this point so i will do what node one dot data is less than node two dot data in this way i have to do something for this first thing will be what tail dot next tail dot next is what node one okay and after that node one is what node one i will update to the next node of node one node one dot next equal to nay no, sorry node one equal to node one dot next okay i think this point is also clear and otherwise otherwise we will be just reversing it with node two so tail dot next equal to node two and node two equal to node two dot next okay all right and uh, after that this while loop will end now here look so now my let's say i have reached this one three it's my tail now i will be updating my tail as well so tail equal to tail dot next okay in this way and uh, after that i will just return the reverse of my link list so reverse of new head dot next okay why next because look zero is this anything but i'm just storing it for a node because we cannot have a null node in the big okay so new node this but i have to i have to not reverse this next i don't include this next in my reverse okay i think you are getting this and uh, after that here i will just make a function which will uh, reverse my link list so static it will return me a node the function name is reverse it's accepting a node as well let's take node okay or let's take anything like head all right great so as i've already explained i will be having one current equal to head and previous equal to null okay and i will run this loop till when i will run this loop till my current not equal to null okay i'm not updating head because at last i will be returning that only okay all right so as i told i will take a net temp variable and i will make it point to current dot next okay so uh, one three is there let's suppose only one three so now current is one but my temp will be three okay temp will be three so now what i will do i will do current dot next equal to previous current dot next equal to previous so current dot next is currently temp but now instead of moving forward i will be updating it to the previous node okay so this now just two things update my previous and current so now the previous is equal to current and current equal to temp okay and that's it and at last uh, i will reach to the end and at the end i am doing what previous equal to current so current at last will become null so previous will be the previous node just previous node before current which we have to return so i will do return previous okay that's it let's try to compile this and i think it should run it was a very easy problem but this reverse part was a bit tricky okay okay 15 10 5 3 2 great let's try to compile it i think it will be getting submitted after last long time in the first try okay so if you have loved the solution please don't forget to subscribe the channel because a lot of guys are not subscribing okay yeah it's accepted all right so thanks everyone and i'm gonna see you again tomorrow till then keep on coding and bye and 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 please subscribe the channel as well okay thanks guys